Hey guys, welcome to my studio. I'm here in Indiana, and this is where I recorded a lot of these songs, and this is how I made Ode to James and Linda. I guess this is a better time than any to explain what the heck this song is about. Um, it's kind of a song for Beatles fans, it's for anyone. I'm putting it out now because I know someday I can never put something out this crazy or wacky if I was on a label or whatever. But hey, um, I think it's a fun, catchy song. So who are James and Linda? James is actually Paul McCartney's first name. It's James Paul McCartney. Um, I didn't want to be so forward and be like, this is about Paul McCartney and Linda McCartney. So I just said, Ode to James and Linda, because it just felt right. I don't know. Maybe it feels right because I've said it too many times. But basically, he lost his wife, Linda, to breast cancer, which he lost his mother to breast cancer as well. And um, during her final months, he convinced her to go to Arizona and ride horses. Um, and so this song is just like him convincing her to do that. And there's a lot of little lyric things that I'll get to um, that I think people will enjoy. But let's take a look at the track and um, hope you enjoy. So here we are with the session. Drums are pretty huge here. There's a lot going on. Um, I was going for like a Canyon Moon Harry Styles sound. And this is what we got here. And actually this thing that says moo is actually horse gallops. So here's the drum groove, it's got a kick, a boom kick, which I guess is just another kick that I threw in not to layer on top of it. I think they had a lower, more low end. I had a cajon. And if you take your, a sock with your foot and slide it down the cajon, it changes the pitch. That's why it goes boom, 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 boom. I think I used this drum. I'm like. I do that, which is uh, the same drum I used on Unwritten. A lot of things, guardo, basically just used every percussion thing I had. And it all started with just having a, I wanted a strummy guitar song. And there's a mandolin in there as well. And this little thing, I use Diddy a lot. Love that, it's so sharp and in your face, it's like sounds like a drum. And then to just kind of flesh it out more, there's a piano and an organ. Very simple. And then there's a little bit of And then on top of all of that, there's also some slide guitar, or guitar, electric guitar with a slide on. I had my buddy Mike Patillo do this for me, and I love this thing. I copy and paste this for this intro. I love that. So with everything else. And then the biggest part of this song is the bass, I think. Boo boo doo boo ba boo doo. So here's what I got going on for that. Yeah. Sound pretty good. Yeah, that kind of just rides out throughout the whole song. There's nothing 
crazy about it. Um, here in the bridge, I add a rubber bridge guitar, which is up on the wall. Just arpeggiating the chords. Uh, I added accordion too. Oh, wrong note. That's funny, I didn't know that was in there. So here's two different accordions. same from like my demo version of the song. What's this here? I don't know. Oh yeah. liven things up a bit I have some effects here uh, which is just noise and people talking and things going on just to give it some air and some life I put those on the verses and they cut out um, the form of the song is pretty interesting so let's get into the vocals here Day, obviously the harmony there This little thing here. No, there's no, there's no, there's no. And that's layered with. No, there's no, there's no, there's no way. Who's this? No, there's no, there's no, there's no way. No, there's no, there's no, there's no. Isha Nyhoff, a sir, sang. Just you and you and you and I definitely wanted a girl on this song, so here's Ish always. And so here's her vocals by themselves. Ooh, 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 ooh. And here's mine. Ooh, 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 ooh. Mix in with it. Ooh, 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 ooh. Sounds really good. I like it a lot. And then of course, babe. Let's take you away from here. There's a woo. There's a woo in every song. No, there's no, there's no, there's no way. And here's more than hey. A lot of these vocals were recorded in another session and then brought over here, which is why you don't see a lot of my plugins, but I bounce them with those plugins. Here in verse three, it needed something in this space, so I asked Isha to do some ooze. We is everything. Just leave. Don't have to say goodbye. Across the sea, the cancer leaves if it's only you and I. That big blue sky.
I love that. I think all my songs have me going really high at the end, which is funny. My colleague, Grant, said that um, this song sounded like a wimbo wet, a wimbo wet. And they go, wee So I put that in there, a little nod to him, my colleague. Um, but yeah, that's, that's a lot of it. There's just a lot of vocals stacked on top of each other. Um, a lot of sounds and things and So yeah, that, those are the vocals. I have some of my demo vocals still in here too, um, which is cool. Yeah, there's just a lot of drums. Um, no like groove or set like I had before. Everything was kind of built by itself. A lot of shakers and things. It honestly doesn't need as much drums as it has, but it has it. Um, bass, the keys, the guitar, twang, slide guitar. Man, um, Mike really killed it with this. All these different... Mm. Yeah, Mike! Beautiful. And so I just made a little song just about that story. I thought I was, I was moved by that story and I wanted to put that in the song and kind of share that story a little bit. And um, there's a lot of nods to things that Beatles fans know. So like, um, I, I did a lot of research and a lot of the lyrics are things that Paul actually had said to Linda. Like, you're up on your Appaloosa stallion. It's a fine spring day. He like whispered to her. Um, and so here it is here. Right. song he ever wrote was called I Lost My Little Girl and it's about him losing his mother and so it's so crazy that his mother and his wife um, he lost both of them to breast cancer so in the bridge I say no way hey, no way you can follow And I knew that. I knew that jing 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 would be the perfect start to the flip side of a record. So that's why it's right halfway and it's um, right after Who Knew. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed the song. Go stream Ode to James and Linda. It's been out since July 8th. Please don't sue me, Paul McCartney. And um, if you know Paul McCartney and you're hearing the song, show it to him. That's Chances of that are very slim, but hey, show it to him. All right, thank you. <laughs>